Hello everyone, this is a quick tutorial on how to voxelize your creations in Blender. Uh, this is a rather simple thing to do, although it doesn't turn out as great as it could be, but this is the way I did it in my music video, so, and it's pretty simple to do. I'm gonna quickly create a model using the skin modifier again, which I covered in my last tutorial. And then I'm going to apply materials for the different sections I want. So I want the underbelly white, main body green, eyes black, etc. Good, now, we have, now that we have that done, uh, make sure to apply a the remesh modifier below the armature modifier. It's very important to have it below it, otherwise the effect will not work. Change the remesh modifier to blocks, and then you will be able to see it's now a little bit blocky. Change the settings so it's appropriate to the amount of uh, voxelization you want. Then go to edit mode of the mesh and se click separate by material. Now select the separate pieces of the model which and uh, just make sure you remove the, in the materials tab, remove the top uh, materials that are, remove the materials you don't want. So. Uh, for the white underbelly, you're going to want, of course, the white material only. Same with the rest of the parts. And literally, that is all that there is to it. That's how I made the effects in uh, my music video. Um, there are some extra things to do with it. Um, as you, you'll notice with the animation, there's some bugs. Uh, there's like no, notably a, a flap sometimes that forms between certain areas. And... Uh, but there's also, it's still like, um, the thing is the remesh modifier does not respect the material bounds. I think that's what it's called, respecting material bounds, yes. And uh, it may be a good uh, project for the future. I don't know, uh, this is something not needed for most projects. <laughs> but as you can see, here is also the, uh, you can also uh, add a key for the scale. And this is something I should have done for the music video, which I did not realize it until then. But this is a neat effect that you can do. It'll you can make something like really basic, really voxelized into something more high detail and such. So give that a go. It's very, like I said, very simple, and uh, you can do it very quickly with your models. Uh, if you have a textured model and it's not like based on the balance of the material, it'll not work. Um, but as I said, this is not nothing for something realistic. These are literally blocks, like Minecraft style. And uh, that's about it. Have fun.